What's up everybody, my name is Lambo and we are back with more Ultimate Alliance 1. Well, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 1. We're gonna walk around and talk to some people, then we're gonna go into the next um, mission. Hi, my name's Hank Pym. Dr. Hank Pym. Hello, it's good to see you. I've heard you're going to the Omega base. If you see my cybernetic helmet, could you bring it back to me? It'd be my pleasure, Dr. Pym. <clears throat> excuse me. Ah, uh, excuse me. What have you been up to, Hank? I was working on a new version of my cybernetic helmet. But then Captain America called and said you guys could use somebody with a little technical know-how. You've certainly got that. Hey, I'm glad to be helping out. Besides, I was getting bored working in a lab all day. Have you ever been to the Omega base? Oh, yeah. Well, that's where I was working on my cybernetic helmet. It's a real nice facility. What projects are going on there? I didn't see a whole lot because of security, but I do know there's a team working with gamma bombs, and I think a new study is being done on the super soldier drug. Thanks, Hank. Come back anytime. We're always open. Greetings. My name is Vision. I will be your primary source of information concerning any persons or locales you might encounter. All right. Unfortunately, my line to the S.H.I.E.L.D. database has a security issue. Would you retrieve a decryption module from Black Widow and bring it to me? I'll be sure to ask Black Widow next time I see her. What is S.H.I.E.L.D.? The acronym stands for Strategic Hazard Intervention, Espionage and Logistics Directorate. Its primary responsibility is counterterrorism for the world. S.H.I.E.L.D. protects the world? Operating under the jurisdiction of the United Nations, S.H.I.E.L.D. is expected to deal with any threat to the security of the world's population. Hmm. Who are the masters of evil? That designation has been used several times over the years, but it is not associated with any particular group of villains. Who's in the latest version of this group? Dr. Doom has assembled dozens of the world's most notorious supervillains, not the least of which is Ultron and Baron Mordo. Mm-hmm. All right, so we heard those two names twice now. God dang it. Who is Dr. Doom? Victor Von Doom was raised in the tiny European country of Latveria. The untimely death of his parents made Doom vengeful towards the world. A genius, he attended Empire State University. Unfortunately, Doom performed a dangerous experiment that resulted in an explosion. As a result, Doom was expelled. Bitter, he traveled the world until he met Tibetan monks who created his first suit of armor. Doom then returned to Latveria, where he overthrew the government and proclaimed himself ruler. Mm. What can you tell us about Black Widow? The Black Widow was a Russian spy who defected several years ago. Upon joining S.H.I.E.L.D., she rose quickly through the ranks until she became Colonel Fury's number one operative. Do you think she can be trusted? There is nothing on her S.H.I.E.L.D. record to indicate otherwise. Why do you ask? No reason. Just yet. Thank you, Vision. I am glad to be of assistance. It's good to see you. Welcome to the team. Hello, Colonel Fury. Are we officially a team? Yes. We're a S.H.I.E.L.D. task force created to investigate the Masters of Evil. It's our mandate to stop Doom and his army before they cause any serious damage. Oh, I didn't know he was done. Which country does S.H.I.E.L.D. belong to? S.H.I.E.L.D. is an international organization. We belong to no one and to everyone. Why are we based in Stark Tower? With the helicarrier seriously damaged, we had to find a different base of operations. Tony Stark offered the use of these facilities. It's a logical choice. It has everything we'll need. Exactly. Though I'm surprised to be here. You see, Stark Industries and S.H.I.E.L.D. recently had a falling out. Mm. There are troubles between S.H.I.E.L.D. and Stark Industries? Yes. Stark recently stopped developing weapons for us. As you can imagine, we were less than enthusiastic. What did you do? S.H.I.E.L.D. tried applying pressure, both legal and not so legal. But I gotta hand it to Stark. He held his ground even though he's lost billions. Thanks, Colonel. Anytime. Hello, my name is Black Widow. I am second in command to Colonel Fury. Hmm. Dum Dum Dugan recently sent a suspicious radio message. 
He requested Colonel Fury visit the Omega base immediately for an update on the Super Soldier Serum. What's suspicious about that? Dugan said Dr. Banner would give the report. The odd thing being Dr. Banner is not on the Super Soldier project. So what do you want us to do? Since we don't know this situation, you are to sneak aboard the base and locate Dugan. From there, we'll determine the best course of action. When you are ready to go, talk to Wyatt Wingfoot. He will take you in a Quinjet. How did you become Nick Fury's second in command? The offer was initially made after a shield operation, where I switched identities with a countryman of mine, Yelena Balova. The other Black Widow? Yes, the blonde one. I declined the offer, but as we all know, Colonel Fury can be very persistent. What is the Omega Base? It is a huge mobile shield research facility that is several stories tall. A mobile lab? Yes. It is used to field test some of our most highly classified experiments. The Vision needs the decryption module, by the way. My apologies. I should have given it to him as soon as we arrived. Please, take this to him. Thanks for the information, Black Widow. You are quite welcome. What the hell is that? What is this? Tony Stark's cufflinks. Hmm. All right, then. Oh, here's your decryption module. Thank you for the decryption module. Now I can patch directly into the S.H.I.E.L.D. database. I am glad to be of assistance. Okay, there we go. We got Vision his decryption module. Now all we need to do is go get... Go to the Omega base and go get Hank his cybernetic helmet he won't shut up about. Wyatt, old buddy, what the heck are you doing here? Tony Stark gave me a call and asked if I wanted to help the team out. And you know me. I'm never one to turn down a chance for some adventure. I hear you. Hey, what do you say later on we sneak a few friends in here and have a little party? It'd be a crime to let an awesome view like this go to waste. Johnny, you haven't changed since we were roomies in college. Oh, I've changed. Chicks dig me even more now. Hi, the name's Wyatt Wingfoot. In case you didn't know, I'm your pilot while you're here at Stark Tower. We'll be taking the Quinjet when you're ready to leave on a mission. All right. Wyatt, we need a favor and you're the only one we can ask. Sure. What do you need? So we found a laptop on the helicarrier. Could you discreetly find someone to see what's on it? Discreetly? As in, don't let Fury know? Yeah, I can do that. Give me a little bit. I think I know just the person to ask. Who will you have look at the laptop? There's a hacker I know. He's kind of an oddball, but I think he's up to the challenge. If you don't mind me asking, whose laptop is this? It might belong to the Black Widow. So, you think Natasha's up to something, eh? Maybe working for the other team. We don't want to say anything until we know what's on that laptop. How come Stark you're driving the point up? And he knows I've flown for the Fantastic Four, so I guess he figured I had the skills. Gosh, dang it. Oh. <laughs> Trying to get at least a little bit comfortable while I sit here and do this. <sighs> okay. How do you know the Fantastic Four? I was roommates with Johnny Storm back in college. He introduced me to the group, and after a while, they started inviting me on missions. What is the Quinjet? It's a high-tech jet developed by Stark's company. It's usually used by the Avengers. What's it got for equipment? It's undetectable to radar, can take off and land itself. Heck, it'll even dial the phone for you. Plus, it's got the latest in jet engine technology. This thing will get you around the world in no time. All right. Mm, all right. Take us to the Omega base. Yeah. Close to the landing zone, so I'll be brief. Dum Dum Dugan recently sent a suspicious radio message requesting I meet him at the Omega base for a report on the latest super soldier serum. What's so suspicious about that? Dr. Banner was to give the report. The only thing is, Banner has been working on the Gamma Bomb project, not the super soldier serum. Dugan would never make a mistake like that. Something's up. What is the Omega base? It's a mobile lab that's over five stories tall. We use it field testing experiments. Oh, Shield's the greatest. 
flying aircraft carriers, office buildings on wheels. Please tell me you've got a tunnel that runs from New York to Tokyo. Spider-Man, this is serious. Colonel, is there anything on board the Omega that would be considered dangerous? If the contents of that vehicle were to fall into the wrong hands... See, Storm's asking the right questions. All mankind. Exactly what are you developing that could threaten the entire planet? That's classified. So it's all right for us to save the vehicle. We just can't know what's going on there. Correct. Now, if I may continue, the team's mission will be to sneak on board the Omega and locate Dugan. He should be able to bring you up to speed on the situation. Any questions? All right, good luck. We made it, Wyatt. We're on board the Omega base. Good. One thing I want to point out. You now have a shield port. It's an experimental device that'll let you transport instantly back to headquarters whenever you want. That should come in handy. We'll be sure to try it out soon. Okay. Good luck in there. Let me know when you want to leave. Wyatt out. Team, satellite recon shows the Omega base is now on a collision course with Bondrak Dam. Thousands of lives are now in danger. Dang it. We must stop the Omega at all costs. Fury out. This just keeps getting better and better. Let's locate Dumcum. <laughs> Been watching too much One Piece. Let's locate Dum Dum Dugan. Hopefully he can fill us in on what's happening. Oh, is this him? Good. They sent a team. Yep. I was afraid I'd been a little too clever with my message to the colonel. Dugan, what happened here? Someone used the base's ventilation system to spread a knockout gas. When I woke up, Dr. Doom demanded I bring Colonel Fury here. If I refused, he was going to ram the Omega into the Vondrak Dam. I think it's, let me move my chair. Ugh. Looks like he didn't keep up his end of the bargain. The Omega's still headed for the dam. Well, then there's no time to waste. Get me to the engineering control room. From there, I'll override navigation and stop this monstrosity. Wait. Team, I just had a thought. The section you're in contains the primary drivetrain. Mm -hmm. You could disable it. The Omega base would be forced to switch to the secondary drive. So would that make a difference? Not much, but it'd give you more time to reach the top of the base. Okay, we'll see what we can do. Thanks, dude. But no. There was this one time whenever I was playing this game, like a long time back, and then Deadpool was like, he killed somebody or he leveled up or something. And he's like, see, now I'm better at doing whatever it is Wolverine does. That made me laugh so much. It just made me laugh. And it made me laugh just now remembering it. Sir, I'm gonna need you to not touch my wife. He was beating the shit out of Sue. Oh my God. Beat the shit out of that. Keep the shit out of this. I just said, quit shooting her. The only person who gets to shoot my wife is me. Alright. Curse that infernal doom. I can't do anything from this control room. Then what can we do? We have to stop the Omega base somehow. Not to worry. There's a control room just ahead. Hopefully Doom left it alone. Get me there, we should be fine. What if he did? What if he destroyed that one too? Who lost the fight? Oh God! Finally a challenge. Crimson Dynamo. Soldiers are no match for my battle suit. We don't want to fight you, Crimson Dynamo. It is wise that you fear me, for with my recent upgrades, I could crush you all like grapes. We're not afraid. We're just in a hurry to stop this base from crashing into a dam. Then you are destined to lose, for I will not let you stop the Omega base. Looks like we're going to have to test out those upgrades of yours. Very well. Then come, comrade. Let us battle. Like, I love how he says he's not going to stop us. Like, he's not going to let us stop the base. But the only thing about that is, you would die too. Like, the logic sometimes is so flawed. Now hurry up, Amber! Okay, ow. Ow, get the frick! Get the frick off me! Spider-Man's belt. Gonna have to give that to him. Dugan, are you coming or not? Sir. Sure. Uh, thing, help me with this. Alright. There we go. There we are. Punch it. 
Dugan, we did it. The drive train is down. Okay, that's him saying it. Good. The base just switched into secondary drive, so our speed is decreased. Will this keep the base from destroying the dam? No, but it gives you a little more time to stop the Omega base. Guess we'd better get moving. Okay. Alright, come on, let's go. Well done, team. Now, let's see about stopping this behemoth. Blasted. All controls have been locked down, except those on the upper bridge. So there's nothing you can do? Correct. We'll have to reach the Damn top it. deck and stop the Omega base from there. Okay, but you stay here, Dugan. We'll need to use the security cameras to see what's in store for us. Sounds like a plan. Good luck. Dugan, we're on lab level. Where to now? Before you go to the top, we got a couple of new concerns you might want to address. What do you mean? Security shows some very sensitive labs have been broken into. One lab contains a device known as the Neural Inhibitor, and another has plans that could be used to upgrade Ultron. Mm. Thanks, Dugan. We'll see if there's any, if there's anything we can do. Okay, I want to change. I want to. Oh. Oh my God, that scared me. <laughs> What's happening? What in the world is going on here? And why are these creatures listed as volunteer? Ah. Uh... Ah, uh, okay. So something must have went wrong with the experiments. Something must have went wrong with the experiments and all the people that volunteered like got turned into those creatures due to something going wrong. All right, what now? Mysterio. Mysterio, step away from that neural inhibitor. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to press that so fast. Dang it, I missed that little bit of dialogue, but it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Uh-oh. That device was the only thing keeping those giants unconscious. Ah, shoot. Now they're gonna wake up and beat our ass. I mean... I mean, uh, they're gonna wake up and be mean. Oh my god, I hate, like, not... See, this is why. It's stuff like, it's examples like that. So, anyone who's not a child, right? Which should be the majority of you. Anyone who's not a childling. It's examples like that. That right there is why my channel is not for kids. Especially because the fact that I'll end up slipping up anyway, just like I just did. But it's just like... Me not saying curse words is not... That's not me being me. Hey, can anybody hear me? I'm stuck in this lab. Someone's in trouble. We should have to help. We help. We have to help them out. Like it's literally me censoring myself, which, in turn, just makes me less. I feel like makes me less entertaining as a person. You know what I mean? It's me, and I like, I like, I like saying curse words from time to time. And by that I mean all I'm the like time. But that's not your business. What the heck is going on around here? There was a huge explosion, and then I couldn't open this door. The Masters of Evil have attacked the Omega base, Dr. Banner. Are you alright? I'm fine. I just hope... Wait a minute. Did you say the Omega is under attack? Yes. They've commandeered the base and have set it on a collision course with Von Trek Dam. We have to stop it. If that dam is destroyed, thousands of people will be killed in the flood. Well, not to mention how much of my work will be lost. Uts. We will. But do you... Oh, but what do you know about the giants that are running around here? Well, those must be the results of the super soldier experiment I've heard about. Scientists are attempting to recreate the experiment that gave Captain America his strength. So far, apparently, all they've created are those giants you've seen. Team, you must be making the Masters of Evil nervous. My security panel shows a gamma bomb has just been activated. You gotta shut it down or all life in a two mile radius will be destroyed. Gee. We're not- we're really not trying to handle something that technical, Dugan. Well, it just so happens I'm kind of a specialist on gamma bombs. Take me to the primary lab and I'll see what I can do. Oh, is this the helmet? Oh, it's his helmet! This must be the cybernetic helmet that Hank Pym wanted back at Stark Tower. Let's take it back to him. Alright, so we're gonna get that to him as soon as we get back. Why don't you hang back here while we check the lab? Alright. Everybody come on. Just in case it's a trap, let me just amp up right quick. Ha-ha! 
forth into a mess with the new punch kick that was supposed to be a kick they've damaged the shut off we have to find the auxiliary lab and reestablish the safety interlock okay dr mayor we'll find the lab stay here where it's safe okay now here's my problem with that why is him being in a why is him being in the same room like yeah i guess nobody's gonna come in here right because he might just lock the door whenever we leave but the thing about that is why is him being in a room with an armed gamma bomb soon to explode the safer option yeah hello do you have a question i do actually What's the super soldier serum? It's a drug that was developed during World War II in hopes of creating soldiers that were stronger and faster than normal humans. So this serum gave Captain America his powers? Yes. Unfortunately, there's something very special about his physique. The drug won't work properly on anyone but him. Why are you here on the Omega? Well, I've been working with a team that's developing a smaller, more powerful gamma bomb. Hmm. What other experiments are being done on the Omega base? Teams aren't allowed to know what each other are doing. Heck, just walking into the wrong section can get you court-martialed, even if you're a civilian. Wild the secrecy. S.H.I.E.L.D. runs this place. They live for all that cloak and dagger stuff. Eh, uh, cloak and dagger. Thanks, Dr. Banner. I'm glad to be of help. Okay, who's next? Dang, I keep missing so goddamn much! Okay. Now I eat him. Get off me. Ugh. Dang it, Cap. Just keep stealing my dang kills. This ain't Fortnite. Got it. Yeah. Alright. Dr. Banner, we reestablished the security in, our, in the lock. Let me see if. Yes, I was able to shut down the gamma bomb. We're safe. Ooh, that was close. That sucker detonated everything within a two mile radius would have been destroyed. Dr. Mayor, stay where you are and lock the door. We're gonna go on without you to stop the Omega base from crashing into the dam. Sounds good to me. I'm no superhero. <laughs> if only you knew. Okay. Yeah. All right. Freeze! Damn it, it's not gonna work on big dudes, I don't think. The daylight's out of Eat chain. How dare you pick up Spider Man by his own piece? How dare you? Yeah. Alright. We gotta go in here now. Alright. Come on. Oh. Oh god. Mysterio. Jeez, it's good to see you. Still got a fishbowl for a head, I see. Mm. Spider Man. Do you always have to be a half wit? Ooh, now that hurt. And speaking of getting hurt, step away from those plans before I have to get medieval on you. You idiot. Why do you think S.H.I.E.L.D. has plans for Ultron? I thought everyone had them. I got some this morning in a box of cereal. These plans are upgrades. The good guys want to capture Ultron so they can rewrite his programming and turn him into a S.H.I.E.L.D. weapon. That's impossible. Ultron is sentient. Reprogramming him is illegal. Yes, it is. But all I care about are these plans. Ultron wants them for the weapon upgrades. <laughs> if your Ultron gets weapon upgrades, then my Ultron will want weapon upgrades, and that just won't do. Huh? I've heard enough of your babbling. Hopefully we don't get copyrighted. That's what I'm trying to say. If you want. Punch him. No. Eat chain. I said eat. Got it. Oh my god. Pheromones. Whoa. Careful. No. Back. Up. I said he chain. God dang it. Oh. See, that was annoying. 
Dugan, we found Mysterio trying to steal the Ultron upgrades. Did you stop him? Yes, but he didn't go quietly. <laughs> no, I don't imagine he did. Nice job. God damn. That was so annoying. I wanna I wanna check out that thing, that ring we just got off the floor. What is this? Spider-Man. No, Spider-Man, your belt, man. What the fuck? To dodge melee attacks. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. Right. <sighs> boss fight was annoying, and I can't believe we just had to go through that, but you know what? Uh, it's fine. It's fine. What's this room? This is insane. How can S.H.I.E.L.D. possibly generate an army using the new Super Soldier Serum? All it does is create monsters. This is a disgrace to the people who worked on the original serum. Mm. True, because it is turning everybody it touches. Like, everybody that they put it in is turning into monsters. So it's not really surprising. It's not really surprising to me that Cap's angry about it, you know? Oh, shoot. That was loud in my headphones. It's going to take a few minutes before we reach the top of the Omega base. Now would be a good time to take a breather. Oh, no. So much for that breather. Get ready to fight, team. Get out of here. I said get out. Bad this. Get back. Don't shoot me. Right back, nah. Go ahead. Shoot me. I said. Shoot me. Dang. What the? What is this? Oh, God. Okay, A. B. 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 A. Oh, okay, okay. Are those just gonna keep dropping down from the sky for no reason? You know what? Most likely. Come on! Bring it! Shut up. X, A, uh, B, X, X, okay, okay. Punch the daylight, oh. Oh! Oh, they're beating the crap out of it. Those super soldiers are trying to destroy that console. We should stop them, I contain valuable research. Okay. Pheromones! If you say so. Here. Here. Chance! Chance! Alright, there we go. I almost thought that wasn't gonna work, because that was literally two moves, two crowd control moves, and they didn't. They still kept hitting the thing. Still kept hitting the thing. Okay, so we can continue on this way. Okay. I'm glad we just did that. Hopefully, that does something. Targets in range this. Get off the thing. Bye. Alright. That seems to be the last of them, but get ready. I'm sure they'll have more surprises for us waiting at the top. Watch out. There's an aim helicopter patrolling the deck. I tried to take it out with this anti-aircraft gun, but it's just too fast. Is there another anti-aircraft gun that we can use? Yeah, at the other end of the deck. But you can't seriously think you're gonna take that chopper out. First, we need to find the anti-aircraft gun, then we'll worry about the chopper. Boy, am I glad to see you guys. I've been trying to unlock the door to the bridge, but a mm -hmm. helicopter keeps strafing the deck. Can you give me a hand? Sure. We'll use that aircraft air, anti-aircraft gun to take out anything that threatens you. Sounds like a plan. All I ask is that you take the helicopter out quick. I don't think I'm going to last long out in the open. Don't worry. We'll protect you. Okay. We got to get down there. Ah, uh, 40 seconds. This one's down. Jump! 
All right. Chain. 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 Dang, chain. Chain. Punch the daylights out you. How'd they not kill you? Come on, chain. Punch. Man, man, I got a new costume. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Kill the helicopter. Shoot it. Good. Good. We have like 20 something seconds left. Got it. The door to the bridge is open. Thanks for the assist. I would have been Swiss cheese if you hadn't taken that helicopter out. Why don't you stay here? We'll check out the bridge. There's no telling what traps AIM might have waiting in there. You'll get no argument from me. I've had enough excitement for one day. All right. All right, all right, okay. I'm glad that, uh, Luke Cage's chain move can, like, pop up people that have shields. That is actually incredibly useful. All right, hit this. Get some of that. There we go. Get all types of money. All types of money. There we go. That's how you get the money. Just by punching the shit. I mean, the daylight's out of something. What are you doing? What are y'all up to? Get here. Sure. Yeah. Spidey, where are you at? Oh, here you are. All right. Come on, everybody. Let's go. Oh, uh, Modoc. Why does it look so flat? What's this? We're frozen in place. That would be due to the entropy device I've developed. You will remain immobile for as long as I hold this button. Oh, goodness. We don't have time for this insanity. Isn't he supposed to say that? Let's begin, shall we? All right, then. <sighs> How far is the Earth from the sun? Uh. Uh. I'm gonna guess. I'm just gonna be guessing these questions. Oh, that was a oh I got it right! <laughs> Move fast before you, before you can immobilize us. What is the half-life of Strontium-90? What even is that? You know what? Oh, your answer is <sighs> correct. Isn't that shocking? Okay, okay, that's funny. Fuck you. Which of the following mm. is not oh, a screw, screw. particle? Uh... Somehow you're oh, I got it right. Run at him while we're free. Which race exterminated itself with technology from the watchers? I don't know. What? Let's not. I do hope you ah! a learning experience. You didn't even tell us the correct answer afterwards. Shut up. Which is not a measurement of time. There we go. This is inconceivable. You're not that intelligent. Okay, we only got shocked twice. We answered all the questions correctly. We're free. The deal is off. You tricked me somehow. God, attack! All I did was answer most of your questions correctly, you play. Get the daylights punched out. You know what? Come on. Right. Jessica, if you would, please. Hit him with the chain. Blast him. Blast him. Punch you in the back of the head is ridiculous. <sighs> with Modok out the way, we can shut. We can shut down the Omega base. Let's go. Modok chip, huh? If somebody cap cap shut the thing down. You did it. You stopped the Omega base. Oh, thank you goodness. No pro problem, Dugan. We can stop huge. We stop huge mobile laboratories that are about to destroy dams all the time. Guys, that was one for the books. But there's no time to relax. Colonel Fury wants you back at Stark Tower immediately. Stay where you are, and I'll pick you up in the Quinjet. You did a good job on the Omega base team. You saved thousands of lives and billions of dollars in shield equipment. Did, did the Masters of Evil steal anything other than some soldiers here? Yes, a device known as the Mutant Amplifier. It magnifies a mutant's natural powers. Damn, so they got something in the mind. So what's our next move? Until we locate Doom's base, nothing. 
And since all we're doing is cooling our heels, I want you to investigate a report that there's a riot taking place in Atlantis. Uh -huh. See Wyatt Wingfoot, and he'll take you to Shields Atlantis Outpost. Or if you'd like more information, talk to the Black Widow. With that being the case, I will see you guys in the next video, which is hopefully coming really soon. I love you guys. Thank you for the support that you've shown so far to all of my videos, not just these ones, but hopefully you've shown support by the time these come out. Hell, make sure you leave a like and take one second out of your day to click the subscribe button. I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you. Bye. Let's move people, we're on the clock. <laughs>